मॉर्निंग व्यूअर्स वाई गुरु जी का खालसा वाई गुरु जी की फतेह वेलकम बैक टू द सेलर्स डिलाइट गाइस वी आर एक्सपीरियंसिंग एक्सट्रीमली रफ सी कंडीशंस हियर इन द साउथ अटलांटिक ओशन इट इज अ नॉर्मल वेदर कंडीशन हियर बिकॉज यहां पे अभी मॉनसून शुरू होने वाला है and uh, we are following all the weather reports but the vessel is uh, rolling up to 15 degrees and uh, extremely pitching very uh, extremely hard on the bow area the anemometer is showing uh, relative wind speed of 36 knots and on the basis of this we calculate the true wind speed Now, as we are in the almost in the middle of the South Atlantic Ocean, we can see यहाँ पे कोई targets नहीं है, कोई ships नहीं है, because uh, it is open sea and uh, we uh, get to see ships very rarely. And here you can see we are doing uh, 9.2 knots. As per the present loading condition, we should have done at least 11 to 12 knots. But uh, sea condition rough होने की वजह से we have wind from right ahead and you can see the sea splashing on the bow. तो हमारी जो स्पीड है वो कम है दिस इज नॉर्मल केस बिकॉज सी कंडीशन रफ है एंड विंड भी आगे से आ रही है सो इट अफेक्ट द शिप स्पीड एंड यू कैन सी वी हैव ऑलरेडी एंटर्ड द साउथ अटलांटिक ओशन दिस इज द पोजिशन ऑफ द शिप जहाँ पे एक्टिस का कर्सर है एंड वी आर अबाउट फाइव हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी माइल्स अवे फ्रॉम परनागुआ जहाँ से हमने डिपार्ट किया था सो एज पर दी एक्टिस अवर प्लान रूट विल बी गोइंग ऑल द वे टचिंग साउथ ऑफ साउथ अफ्रीका एंड ऑल द वे टू द साउथ ईस्ट एशिया राइट नो वी हैव अबाउट एट थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड माइल्स टू गो टू द नेक्स्ट डेस्टिनेशन एंड प्रेजेंटली द ई टी एज कमिंग ट्वेंटी सेवेंथ अप्रैल बट अभी स्पीड चेंज होगी जब सी कंडीशन ठीक होगा So definitely the ETA will going to change because uh, we are not going to get the same weather all through the voyage. You can see the sky is completely overcast and we are experiencing wind force seven. And you can see the waves splashing on the bow area, extremely strong. Mark, uh, what do you think? How long we will be having this weather? Three to four days, but I think it is uh, it's getting better now because the atmospheric pressure is rising. Friends, uh, here you can see we have some water bottles kept here on the alleyway near the stairways. ये uh, this is called a ship's bond. ये bond locker में जाते हैं. इसमें soft drinks, chocolates, wafers. Water bottles. This is all for uh, the crew. Uh, they can purchase it, and uh, for their refreshment, uh, we always order this when the vessel reaches any port. So, guys, our cadet here is uh, checking our self-contained breathing apparatus, also called SEBA, which we use for firefighting. This is the oxy oxygen bottle. Actually, it is not oxygen. It is air bottle, and uh, this you can see is the mask and the pressure gauge. So this is also a routine checking of the SCBS set and the fireman's outfit, which is kept inside this uh, red pouch. So friends, here you can see we have some engine uh, parameters here, and our chief engineer is on command. Uh, he is uh, one of the best chief engineers i have sailed with very helpful and a very respectful person joren kabhi joren abhi to yaar mausam pehle se to better hai ha sir yaar do din se to better better hai aaj ha thoda rolling kam ho raha hai aur splashing bhi thoda kam ho raha hai even wind speed bhi thodi kam hai but fir bhi hai na wind speed to totally maximum kam ho gaya sir aaj yeah ठीक है इट विल बी बेटर आई थिंक यस सर यस सर तो दिन में तो मोस्टली ठीक हो जाएगा लगता है सो मार्क हाउ लॉन्ग यू थिंक दिस वॉशिंग विल टेक 
this one sir, I think I will finish it one day. One day, yeah. So, ET was already coming, maybe we need to fix this uh, plug. Yes sir, we need to take this up there, then... Uh, Third, are we going to lower anything inside? Are we going to lower something inside? Yes, sir. What? Uh, three is straighter. Lowering or picking up? Picking up, picking up. Okay. Friends, uh, this small hatch is called the engine room skylight. Ye deck pe khulta hai. And it goes uh, to the engine room. There you can see we have a sea chest strainer. Jo abhi hum isko niche se upar uthane wale hai. And we are going to do cleaning. And we will use this uh, provision screen to pick up. Our deck crew is uh, having a very tough time in this rough weather because uh, the winds are very strong. It is very difficult to stand. Even एक दूसरे की बातें सुनना बहुत मुश्किल है because जो हवा की speed है वो बहुत ज़्यादा है और आवाज़ बहुत ज़्यादा हो रही है and uh, they are not able to communicate properly also. But still the work is going on and uh, I admire all my crew members for their hard work and dedication. Our galley staff is also finding it very difficult to do the cooking because the ship is rolling and pitching very heavily. So, यहाँ पे जितने भी utensils पड़े होते हैं and सामान है वो नीचे गिरता रहता है. So, this is a very challenging uh, part for the galley department, and it is very unsafe also because अगर उनके ऊपर कुछ गिर जाए, then definitely they are going to get injured. And uh, our mess man and chief cook, but uh, they are. Cooking and uh, preparing food continuously for the crew. So this is one of the toughest part of the ship's job. That even if uh, the weather is rough in any kind of sea conditions, the cooking has to continue. Friends, uh, we have been experiencing uh, extremely rough sea conditions and uh, uh, heavy weather since the time we have departed from Brazil. Uh, we had received uh, the weather reports. But uh, it did not look that uh, it didn't look that it will be so bad. But uh, still, we are experiencing it, and uh, we are trying our level best to continue working. We are expecting that the weather will be fine within a few days because the uh, आगे की weather reports हैं वो यही बता रही हैं कि sea conditions improve होंगे and uh, wind speed थोड़ी कम होएगी. So we are expecting that uh, within few days that uh, the sea and uh, the weather conditions will be better. इस rough sea condition की वजह से काफी problems आई हैं. because uh, we are not able to work properly on deck and uh, our few crew members they were feeling seasick uh, kisi ko vomiting hui hai uh, body ache shuru ho gaya hai and uh, headache hota hai so this is a, a normal problem it happens uh, especially for the youngsters who have just uh, taken up this career but still uh, we have to transport the cargo safely from the port of loading and uh, we are on it still we have about uh, 35 to 36 days more to reach the de uh, next destination as per the present uh, weather conditions uh, we have advised our crew members not to go on the deck so that uh, they can be safe inside so friends uh, very soon we are hoping that uh, the weather will be fine and uh, we will get on to our normal uh, daily routine and continue working as we do always 
so this was it guys i hope you like my today's story uh, please do subscribe to my channel stay happy stay safe thank you for watching